video, we're talking strategies to help you cope when you're scared of needles. You know, it's hard to avoid needles when we have to go to the doctor's office, whether that be for blood work, for vaccines, or hey, even Botox. But these tips that I'm about to share with you have been proven to work with repeated practice. And I used to also work with people that were terrified of working with needles. So let's talk about some tips that are gonna help you manage your fear next time you're at the doctor's office. Before we talk tips, it's important to know what's causing and maintaining your fear. In this case, you think something bad is going to happen. So it's really important to ask yourself, what do you think that is? Once you know what that is, get the facts, because guess what? Once you know what that is, more often than not, you're going to realize that the what it is that you're scared of is either so impossible or it's so unlikely to happen that you're already immediately going to feel better. So regarding fear of needles, people often think that it's going to hurt, that the needle's gonna get stuck, or that they can get sick from it. So now let's go to the doctor's office so we can um, do some fact checking and use some of the skills that I'm about to show you. So once at the office, the first you're gonna do is you're gonna ask for numbing cream, and this is often called Enla. Why is this important? Well, because if you use this, it's going to numb the entire site of where the needle is going to be injected in, and you're not gonna feel a thing. The second thing we're gonna do is after we have the numbing cream applied and we're waiting for this to take effect, it can take a few minutes, we're gonna to try to get in a relaxed state. And we're gonna do this by either one, uh, doing some deep breathing, two, we're going to visualize a very relaxing place, or three, you can tense and relax your muscles. This is an exercise called progressive muscle relaxation. I get it big word, and this is a skill that you can also learn more in depth with a licensed clinical psychologist. And when the doctor comes back in after the numbing has taken effect, you will be completely numb, so you're not gonna feel anything, you're gonna have your facts regarding needles, and you're going to be relaxed, or hopefully relaxed. So when the doctor is about to give you your shot or the Botox, make sure that you continue doing your relaxation exercises or do something distracting. Distraction is your best friend. So this means talking to your doctor or your nurse about something unrelated to needles, or it can mean listening to calming or relaxing music. Just one thing to mention, do not whatsoever look at the needle because that's only gonna get you more fear. That's it. So what did you think? Hopefully these tips help you manage your fear next time you have to visit the doctor's office, whether it be for blood work or getting some Botox. But thank you as always for following and watching along. Don't forget to hit subscribe right over here so you can stay up to date with all the latest and greatest videos. And you can check out older videos over here. And don't forget to leave a thumbs up. Leave a comment below letting me know what you guys would like to see next. I'll see you guys soon.